Rice has been a staple food for thousands of years, feeding more people over a longer period of time than any other crop. Today it feeds roughly half of the world's population every day. Meet an urban Filipino family who relies on rice. Their household of three adults and four children consumes 10 kilograms of rice each week. Like many of the people in Asia, for most of the world's poorest people live, rice is their staple food. I don't think I can. I don't think I can. I'm telling you to say, Mom, I'm going to die. I'm not going to die. I'm not going to die because it's important for people to die. I'm going to die. Present at almost every meal and often accompanied by little else, rice can provide up to 70% of their daily energy. Beyond Asia, the importance of rice is also quickly rising, with other parts of the developing world beginning to consume and grow more rice. In Africa, rice is quickly growing into a popular staple food, while in Latin America, it is becoming more and more significant, especially for the country's urban poor. Rice is also special because it can thrive in wet environments where many other crops fail. Its production supports more than 200 million small-scale farmers worldwide. The challenge today is the rise in population in rice-consuming countries that could see demand outstrip supply, a possibility that would lead to higher rice prices and greater poverty. If you look at last 10 years, the rice prices have been rising since 2001. Bottom line is in, in the next 35 years, we still need to produce another additional 115 million tons of milled rice in a sustainable manner. We don't have additional area to bring in, so we need to produce more with less. Building on more than 50 years of finding scientific solutions and technologies to help rice farmers, the Global Rice Science Partnership, or GRISP, brings together more than 900 research and development partners from around the world to advance the impact of rice research. Now with GRISP, we have for the first time ever a globally concerted effort where all these partners work together to fulfill the same mission, objective and goals. GRISP will produce new varieties, new crop management technologies that will increase yield and will increase production. So in that way it will contribute to food security. GRISP will also deliver management technologies that will be environmentally friendly. The goal is to help farmers grow rice with less resources, such as water and labor, and reduce losses from challenges such as drought and salinity. Through GRISP, farmers will be better able to face such productivity challenges as climate change, while rice consumers will have access to higher quality rice that's more affordable and more nutritious. Research that delivers solutions to help improve the health and lives of rice consumers and farmers would not be possible without partners and donors. Donor funding is extremely important to keep a program like CRISP going. Continuous support is needed because agricultural research takes a lot of time to develop new products. Hand in hand, CRISP scientists and partners are delivering new ways to help farmers increase rice productivity and improve environmental outcomes. The aim isn't just to reduce poverty, but to end it. Join us as we help deliver a better world through rice science.